Hello guys, this is Gamma and I'm going to try and disprove the idea that AI can see through walls or other objects. So, in this scene we have a player, we have two AI group and some objects that will uh, will serve as, as a test of a, an obstruction. So let's start it and going to the spectator view to have an idea of the, what the objects are without triggering the stuff so those are the two AI, this is the player these are the objects that, are, that we are going to check against and I made a script to, to check for that what the script does is it draws some lines based on both the position of perceived threats uh, that is near targets command script command in, in army 3 and uh, the player position and the player position depending it's very body so something has already something was already detected I'm going to spectator mode and this is very fortunate because despite both AI enemies were in sight only one was actually uh, detected. This is very useful for the purposes, purpose of this video because right now the perceived position of the leader of this group is the end of the tip of this point, of these lines. This other AI, I didn't give time for the engine to simulate that detection. Since I am a player, not an AI, this is uh, practical is moot for the purpose in this case uh, since I'm a player but an AI would detect the same and in this case if I were an AI over there um, I didn't give the engine time enough to detect this unit only this one was detected and the script finally triggered showing depending on those points, so the points are the feet, the knees, the hips, the elbows, the shoulders and the head and in this case only the head is in line of sight uh, to that unit and to the other one probably too, I, I, I don't see it right now but we'll be able to see it soon enough so the green color is for obstructed lines and the red is for unobstructed. Going back to, to the player view. So soon enough we should detect the other unit. I'm giving plenty of time. There it is. So we have now the both units detected. In this case I'm 80% under coverage. Uh, actually they're better seen from the third person view. Okay, yeah, I, and now I'm going to show, try to make the AI react to myself. Since they're facing back, they haven't detected me yet. And now for another test, I'm going to shoot. They should be able to hear me. I know I am occluded, so they can't see, me, but they should be able to, to hear me. And this should trigger them some, some kind of reaction and actually it did actually it did so they have detected par they have partially detected me I'm going to spectator mode okay right now this tip here is the position that the enemy AI thinks I am so that's the perceived position of the AI they have detected there was some something going on and they, they flagged it as a, a danger danger thing but they don't know the exact place of it in, the, in this case they are all red because the lines are all red though they are uh, intersected by the terrain that's why uh, but red should represent unobstructed uh, right now the script doesn't doesn't detect that doesn't detect uh, terrain uh, obstructions. It's possible, though. Um, so, 
they're facing they were facing north more or less and now they're facing that way more or less so they they're, tr they're trying to detect the actual enemy position i'm not giving them that chance because i'm absolutely obstructed right now i'm going to try and make them update that position going back to spectator modes or out of spectator modes third position more shots nothing happens they're not updating the position want to reload this should this other shot should help them figure more better my position and I believe this was some functionality that was actually present in earlier versions I'm going to now show a tip of myself okay I'm showing a tip of myself and I'm going to shoot okay that was good enough they have detected me already I'm going to hide myself again they have updated the, the, the position where they think I am Okay, this is important because they have updated with a good level of accuracy even my my height as you can see the tip of their perception is at my feet more or less but you'll see something if I move myself they haven't updated this is the main point they still think I am over there and I'm not I'm moving behind cover. They don't know where I am. The updates you having is only the updates of my own um, my own lines, the lines coming from me. Now let's do another thing. I'm going to move and stay behind here. They didn't see me. Now they did. They're updating my position. I'm going to hide. Okay. I'm going to stay at this position. They have updated. And now they haven't. So they are extrapolating. The perceived position is completely wrong right now. They have updated, um, extrapolated, and updated the, the perceived position based on the earlier movement that I was having. I was moving to the right, and so they have uh, extrapolated my position over there. This is actually something that B could so do something about it because. Um, it's blatantly obvious that there's no enemy over there uh, so they should update that position back to at least the last accurate known position the last position that corresponds to the actual position of, of, uh, of the enemy unit so I'm going to let them update again and to show a bit of myself okay they have updated I'm going to move okay as you can see you see those that that is the perceived position that they're using right now it's going to the left that was based on my earlier movement but once again uh, well in this case that position is obstructed so it, it wouldn't make sense to the thing that I said earlier but on on the other case let me show again I'm moving I'm moving I'm stopping okay this didn't trigger the effect I'm going to trigger it again okay there you see I'm hidden in the position oh I, I'm dead right now but I think that made my point see you next time